would I like to have different in an education session? And just go in and, and you know, bang at that. Uh, it offers a moment which is a synchronized moment where you know people set aside time to work together in that specific time frame and that usually helps a lot with being uh, you know more efficient the, the great thing about free and open source software is that it is open to collaboration everybody can contribute as they wish these are amazing aspects i mean who wouldn't be motivated to participate in a hackathon like this because it gives you the chance to to create a credential for your own competence. Uh, hello, everyone. And uh, hello, everyone. Hey, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hello, all. Hi. There's something incredibly optimistic about events like this one, because if you think of it, um, um, just like that, out of nowhere, within a matter of, of, of a few weeks, we can put together an event where hundreds of people come together, hundreds of people that never met before, and we all together start creating and, and, and trying to solve a problem. That we, we did put up some challenges. We put four challenges to serve as inspiration uh, for everybody. Uh, we put breakout rooms, integration with PeerTube, some reactions and, and file sharing uh, integration. But you don't necessarily need to build one of these four. Their open source is global. And in that case, uh, we, if it's about improving society, we do not care if these contributions come from anywhere else around uh, the globe, outside Europe. We are happy to adopt them, to embrace them, to contribute to them. For me, it's new. And I'm hoping that maybe I can learn as much as I'm able to share. I'm definitely eager to to help you out and as Mihai said we should uh, all learn from each other and uh, try to figure out the best solutions for our purpose. On a moment's notice we can gather so much um, potential and, and and we can get just so much work done um, with with no you know significant preparation I, I really really love this so with no further ado let's go and check out the winners of the hackathon um, you're going fast you're going very fast I'm very excited about it so the quality of projects that I've seen in this hackathon is really really high and the time frame is just a week and what we saw is amazing. Uh, we're seeing people post in the community, get feedback. Um, we, we encourage people to share their work as work in progress pull requests on our public repositories. And we've seen the positive response from our community. Uh, we've seen our documentation improved by members of teams that saw things not very clear. Um, and we've seen um, new engagement in our community, existing community members participating. Um, so, by all means, this has been a success from, from our side. And in the same way, you use public funds to fix a bridge or to build a road or just to plant trees in a park. I think more and more governments, they should also try to allocate certain helps to maintain this open source software. I work uh, for the Madrid Open University and, and we are maintainers uh, of the Moodle plugin. I'm Ilma Hayevsky and I represent the University of Illinois at Chicago. I am Emba. I am a software developer from Istanbul, Turkey. We are a team of students of uh, Internet Engineering School called San Francisco Lake in France. We look at you, you're coming from all over the world. And it was, I was totally stunned when I went through the, the, the list of participants. And you are all working together here with the same mission. You're creating for a fantastic open source project. And I, I can't say how much I admire the initiative behind this of Emil and the, and the Jitsi team. What I really like about open source is how it removes barriers to collaboration. That's it. It's not that you get stuff for free. Um, it's, it's, it's not about ideologies, it's the fact that it makes it easier for people to work together. So my name is uh, Sean Finko, Chief Technical Officer for um, the Startup in EdTech here in Vietnam. I'm Julia from Spain, um, I'm also a university student. And so I'm Jeremy from Canada. 
and this is my first hackathon. Um, I'm 43, so you know. <laughs> uh, I am Gilistan. Uh, I am attended from uh, Istanbul, Turkey. Uh, I am software developer and researcher. My name is Jeroen van Metal, JBB. Um, originally from the Netherlands, but uh, living in Houston, Texas these days. Cool. I mean. Just look at, at what we have, you have done, especially thanks to you guys. In one week of work, we have 21 projects. As Thomas said, some of your ideas will be used around the globe. So you are having an impact on society. You are improving lives, you are improving education. So I definitely, the only thing I can say again, apart from Emil and Thomas, I repeat it again. Thank you for your active participation. And definitely, we, this is something we should repeat in the future. So, thanks.